like have them raise their hand for something. You know, how many people have underwear on? You know, I mean something. Um, <laughs> I mean anything to get their attention. I mean you've got a, a friend of mine. He's a magician, and he he but he's also has like this huge company. And so in the very beginning, he starts with the magic act. Well, seeing I don't do magic, but I can ask questions. So engaging the audience in some sort of random question. And then for me, I take that, I try to bring that into whatever I'm talking about. And then I have to bring it, I always like to bring it full circle. Like, so wherever I started, I end, and it's full circle. They may not, it's kind of like when you're writing a book. You write it about, you, you know how like books will start at the end? Mm -hmm. And you can't quite figure out why they're starting there. Mm -hmm. But then when it ends, it's like, oh, I get it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I kind of, I kind of, I, I think maybe I talk like I would write. Mm -hmm. I see everything like a play or a movie. Mm -hmm. So public speaking for me, I see it like a movie because I bore easily. Mm -hmm. So I do not want to listen to somebody or I can't, I can't listen to a, uh, you know, a public speaker who is boring. I always 